step in the right direction when it comes to keeping your kids safe. I'm Josh Rowe. And I'm Catherine Marshan. Hamilton County is one of nearly a dozen schools to be threatened with violence since the shooting in Parkland, Florida. Now they're unveiling technology they say will ensure student safety just by scanning someone's ID. Stephanie Santastasi gives us a first hand look at how it works. Stephanie. Yeah, Josh and Catherine, the system is actually pretty neat. Right now it's being tested in four Hamilton County schools. If all goes well, it'll be in every school by the end of April. One parent we spoke with says it gives her peace of mind knowing her children are safe. Keeping kids safe in school, a topic that's top of mind for parents and school leaders everywhere. I'm worried about them when they're with me and when they're not. Laurel Saxon is a mother to three kids. Two of them attend school here at CSAS in Chattanooga. She does her best to volunteer at the school as much as she can. Probably once or twice a month. But today when she walked into the office to check in, she noticed something much different. It was a little bit bizarre because all of us would normally walk in, sign up, and the whole office had been rearranged. Instead of just signing her name on a clipboard, Saxon was asked to give her ID. Clerical assistant Teresa Harrison then placed it inside this Raptor system device. With a quick scan, the machine runs an instant check against the registered sex offender databases in all 50 states. It can also check against custom databases for custody alerts or any banned visitors who shouldn't be on campus. If there's an issue, it automatically emails and texts our administrators, the sheriff's department, and the national sex offender registry. If the system finds nothing wrong, it prints out one of these. Hamilton County Schools says this is just one step in the process of ensuring schools are safe learning environments for kids. Saxon couldn't agree more. I like that they know who's coming and who's going and then we have to have the ID available too. Now the district is also working to add cameras to the outside of the doors of schools so you can see a person before they're allowed to come inside. They're hoping to get those installed at every school this summer. Josh. Thank you, Stephanie. Right now the Raptor security system is up and running at CSAS, East Hamilton Middle and High School, Eastside Elementary and Westview Elementary.